Hi everyone! Welcome to our channel! I'm Carol. I'm Lisa. And today we're going to be stuffing this uh, box with all this money! <laughs> so all this money comes from, uh, you know, any time that we spend, um, well this is mine, uh, not Lisa's, but any time I spend money out of one of my cash envelopes, any time I get ones or fives, it goes in here. And so do the receipts, which I've already gone through uh, in the last video with you guys. Um, but we're going to go ahead and stuff this. So I haven't done this in a while. So this is for like the past couple of months, not just for June. So this is probably encompassing part of April and May and part of June. So mm -hmm. it's, it's been a while since I've done this. Okay. Um, but I've gone through and saved every penny, every dollar, every five. So I'm shaking the camera <laughs> is what Lisa's said. I'm so sorry. Am I shaking it? I am shaking it. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I will attempt to not do that in the future. Um, <laughs> no promises, though. All right. Let's see. Whoa. Let's dump it. Let's dump it. Let's dump it. Look All right. Two money bags. Money bag is empty. All right. So let's count it first. Should we count it first? Sure. Let's separate it. And face it in the same direction? I don't care about the same direction. All right, so okay. fives and ones. Mom, help me. Alex, you got a handle? You gonna help? I think you can do it. I have faith in you. I've got it. Okay, fives and ones. That's a good chunk of change you got there. Yeah, it's pretty good. And I'm actually really good about not touching this. Um, the only time that I get into my fives and ones is for like tip money. If, you know, it's like they really don't deserve like a 10 or more, you know. Mm -hmm. If they, I feel like they honestly deserve like a dollar or two, then I'll get into this. But other than that, I'm, I don't touch it. Mm -hmm. And I think that's fair because, I mean, like you got to leave something, you know, when you go out to eat because that's just rude if you don't. And, um, but sometimes Ooh. you don't feel like they deserve $10, you know? You know, what if, I would love to know what the people think about, uh, tipping culture these days. Yeah. Where, you know, it's like every place you go to, even like the Starbucks drive through do they have, you know, a, a tip jar for the people who yeah. are working the drive through Yeah. Um, my, our money is already taxed way, way too much. I mean, it's taxed when we get paid and then when we buy something it's taxed it's just we're taxed out the yin yang anyway yeah so to then tip on top of the tax and the purchase price i mean i'm all for tipping servers and people who truly do you know their yeah, livelihood on, is yeah. is customer service in that way but Tipping culture these days is, is yeah. getting a little out of control, I do yeah. believe. Yeah. I mean, yeah, but also, like, if you go out to eat, you got to tip. I yes. mean, it's, that's... Absolutely. U.S. of A. It's, you know, it's, they get paid, like, you know, what, a dollar <laughs> per hour. It's ridiculous. Bad, yeah. So, um, yeah, it's supposed to be on the company to pay them a fair wage, but also, like, it's just what you do, so. Yeah. All right, guys. So let's okay. let's see how much this is. Sorry. So, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty. Fifty bucks in fives. Eight, nine, seventy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eighty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, so eighty-nine doll hairs. Eighty-nine. And then I don't care about the change. We ain't got to count that. Hang on. Here's ninety. Ninety bucks. Here's ninety-one. 
50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Two. Two. Okay. Uh, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Perfect. All right. That's a lot of money. Yeah. Perfect. So now we're going to take, I don't know, three or four dollars at a time, half it, and stick it in the box. Here, I can help you. I can help you with holding the money. I mean, like, th th do you ever? Uh, I, I say this sometimes when I get fives or ones. I'm like, when I get them back instead of a ten, I'm like, oof, oh, I'm yeah. doing the five and one dollar challenge. I can't spend this. And then I feel like I need to explain what the five and one dollar challenge is. And most people are like, oh, that's a really good idea. Yeah. Like, Heck yeah, man. It's an easy way to save a couple buckaroos. Sure is. It's getting hard to stuff. <laughs> it's getting hard. Oh boy, you need a spatula. <laughs> I know. Do it in halves only. Oh, in halves only, okay. We learned our lesson about crinkling them up. You need a spatula to help. Yeah. You want to go get a spatula? <laughs> you won't go in there. <laughs> this is funny. Yeah, any thin thing that can be taken down in there first. It's having a hard time. It just wants to poke back up, y'all. Mother has gone to grab a spatula. Hurry up, quick, emergency. Okay. See, I found this. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, just don't poke holes in it. Poke holes in what? The money. Did that give you a little bit of room? Yeah, actually, thank you. You're welcome. Dang. That's a lot of money you got in there. Help me with the change, Charlie. And you can't, I like these clear acrylic banks because you can't get into them unless you oh, yeah. bust them open. You have to bust these open. Yeah. Very cool. You did a good job, Carolyn. Thanks. Hard right, to do with guys. these nails. How do y'all save money, guys? What Are y'all doing any uh, fun challenges that maybe we don't know about? We do the uh, $1 and $5 challenge here. Um, this yeah. is the main one that I do. Um, I feel like it helps a lot mm -hmm. to just save like random dollars and fives um, okay. that otherwise I would spend. So Too let me sure. know down in the comments what, what you do. So, sorry, that was very shaky. Um, <laughs> I've got 20s, I've got hundreds in here. Uh, there's tons of money in here that we counted it at one point and I've done forgot how much it was, but there's tons of money in yes. there so uh, that's going to be I don't know this is what I consider to be my emergency fund at the moment like if crap hits the fan and we gotta have like a thousand bucks like right then and there this is my go-to yeah um, mine too and then if my if I'm like on the verge of being debt free then I'll bust this open to make a last payment even you know yes. so there's not a hundred percent like a set plan for it but as of right now it's an emergency box um that has been accruing for six plus months yep um so there's six plus months of ones fives in there plus you know the random 20 50 uh, or 100 so all right guys thanks for watching let us know down in the comments what you do to save money and uh we hope you have a great, great day or night wherever you're at bye, bye.